Oh, here comes the son of a bitch himself. <laughs> uh, he, the man you caught. Nope, I did not. Listen, I did not cost him the DIW championship. Simple, simple fact of the matter is, I helped him, okay? He would have been destroyed later on by somebody else anyway, so I just helped him, you know, get picked off quite easily by Darren Matthews. Same thing, the pain later on down the line. That's what I did. Yeah, yeah, if you see, listen, this guy got chopped off a fire truck and came back the next week, so I'm pretty sure he could survive a little, a little kick to the face. A little kick to the face. He nearly, he nearly ended, his career nearly ended in that match against the Exterminator. Then with, but adding what you and Darren Matthews did, that could have paralyzed him or affected his life very badly. I'm surprised well, he he's still standing. He would have been lucky if he got paralyzed, at least it will save him all the pain and torture he's about to go through at the hands of my friend, my good buddy here, Darren Matthews. Since when has he ever been your friend? I, I mean, you guys never been friends until the screw job. Well, listen, you see, Darren Matthews on camera, he was friends with Ryan. That was simple, simple matter of fact, it was a ruse, okay? He told me that he couldn't stand talking to the guy, he wanted to throw up in his mouth continuously every time he was near him. That's how much he hated him, but he had to pretend, he had to try and worm his way into his company, so when the time was right, when the opportunity pro produced itself, BOOM! Cash in! With my help, of course, his best friend. Just because we don't talk on camera doesn't mean we aren't friends, Socko, my friend. Wait a minute, my friend, you're not my friend. <laughs> You're not good enough to be my friend. Well, you're not gonna be my friend. <laughs> of course, yeah. <laughs> I'm friends with the DRW champion. Who are you friends with? Man, I'm friends with many people. Yeah, I highly doubt that. I, mean, really, I can get four of them out here right now as I hurt you, but you know. <laughs> you know very well that I could just take them out. Simple, just snapping my fingers and. Oh come on, Rev! You didn't even ring the bell yet. But one thing I don't get is how Ryan wears that kind of shirt and it stays on and doesn't get in his way. I mean, if I, can, I can understand if it's a regular t-shirt, but... Ow. Does it really okay. matter? It look, makes um, it look like the douche for years. That's all that really matters in this situation. Nah, the, he only looked like that in 2009. Well, good... Two, yeah. Good for him. Uh, no, not 2009, 2010, whatever. Pre early 2010, whatever. Yeah. Come on, if we can't allow this kind of thing. He's smashing his head on steel steps. You would you like me to do that to you, Raph? Oh, come on, look at this. This is revenge right here. How is it revenge? This is uh, yeah. Come get on, off Ryan, take off the table piece. Ryan, get away from me now. No, 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 don't go over to him. But oh. I could hear the I could hear what Ryan's saying. Yeah, and I can hear it too, and I don't think the people want to be hearing what he's got to say. He just said "fuck you, Viper." Good for him. He can say whatever he like. Fact of the matter is, he isn't good enough to even lace up my boots or Darren Matthews, so he can run his mouth all he wants. Um, he's getting his revenge tonight, and he might be getting at you. But tonight, this even though the DIW title is on the line, this. For Ryan, this isn't about the big thing. Is not about winning the back the DIW world, the DIW title. It's about getting revenge on what what he thought was a good friend of his, uh, screwing him over in the Atlanta screw job. What yeah, Atlanta. What the? Are you serious? Are you actually serious? He's spitting in his face now. What kind of man does that to another human being? Seriously. It's so disrespectful. Well, at least well, when Illusion did it, well, there was chemicals in it. Well, God knows what... He probably put that in the fan... He put the p planted that in the fans. Probably put something in it, like chloroform or something. I wouldn't expect any less from this bastard. You, you really do hate Ryan this much, do you? Of course. He shouldn't even be anywhere near the DRW Championship. Every time he competes for it, he devalues the title tenfold. I mean, my man here, Darren Matthews, he's 
10,000 times the champion Ryan could ever dream of being. Well, if you give Ryan, Ryan deserves to be the IW champion no matter what you or anyone oh. else says. I mean, he did something that pretty much no one could do. Excluding Dan's phony title reign, um, beat the Exterminator for the world title. Yeah. You see, the Exterminator was suffering from swine flu. We all know that, okay? Swine flu? Yeah, if swine. he was suffering from swine flu, Ryan would have the swine flu right now, would he? So no excuses. Or well, he's just more resistant to that kind of thing than Exterminator, that's all. You see, he grew up in a dirty household. He, he grew immunities to these kind of things when he was with his crack whore mother. But you see, Exterminator, <laughs> he was in a posh household. Well, not posh, but... You know, he he had wealth, he had money, he had all the fine things in life. And his mum actually cleaned the kitchen. He, she cleaned the floors. That's funny, that's really funny. Oh my oh. god, shooting star press to the outside. The exact uh, I assure you, Ryan's had a pretty nice house, but I, I've never stepped foot in it. But, I mean, it, if that's true, Ryan's had lived in that dirty environment. He, I know he, his current house is, and it's pretty clean. Well, that's good for him. Fact of the matter is, this guy grew up in a dirty household, and that reflects right in his personality. He is just yeah. a disgusting human being, and this shouldn't even be allowed to compete here. This is not the um early. Wait, look at this. Honestly, can you tell me that you would, you would willingly hit another human being with a search hammer? I would. <laughs> I mean, I've been thinking about it for the past like months now, but you know. Well, you're just as bad as this, this freak of nature, right here. Yeah, but um, uh, I've been thinking of Wait, pins going oh. closer to me than you think. Yeah, Soko, I wouldn't try that if I were you. You see, uh, even, I wouldn't even, say anything about Ryan because that could be you right there. <laughs> Listen, Darren Matthews is just having a rough spell right now. And honestly, if I was in there, I'd be all over Ryan. But of course, Darren Matthews will be in a moment, as you can see right here. See, look at that. Look at that. Beautiful. Oh, referee, Mon get, in, get in there. Oh! Yes. Choke the living sh crap out of him. Come on. No, a slow count. Come on. Not even a one count. Really? The referee was just doing his job. I mean... No, he, look at it. He had to run halfway across the ring just to get to the pin. Now, how come on? I'm pretty sure that's. Slow oh, oh, come on, ref. One, two, what? Come on, ref, count One, it. Two. Oh, slow count again, really? I've never seen that before in Call Wrestling. Neither have I, but if any two men could do it, it's Darren Matthews and any some random jobber. Oh, wait, that's Ryan in the ring, isn't it? I forgot. Oh, uh, just when I thought you were going to put over Ryan, you, you, you find a way to trash him. Yeah. Because it. Oh, so look at Ouch. that. Ouch. You, you already knocked Ryan to the outside and then you kick him. He's diving over. I mean. See, Darren Matthews will not let up on this guy. He knows that he needs to put Ryan out of action indefinitely to save these fans from this pitiful specimen of nature. They don't want to see him anymore. I don't want to see him anymore. Matthews the the, the GW fans, they love Ryan. Ryan, they. You can see there's been polls of who you want to asking who you want to see a, be DIW champion one day, and Ryan lead that poll. Good for him. I don't really give a crap. You know he rigs those kind of things, right? He's one of those internet darlings where everybody on the interwebs loves him. Fact of the matter is, he can get his stupid friends to click Ryan, Ryan, Ryan every single second of the day. Are you trying to Michael Cole me? No, I just think on the same w wavelength for that brilliant, brilliant man. Oh God, you're a coal miner. I'm not a coal miner. He's a viper. By no, that... <laughs> I'll come up with something. Okay. Oh, oh brilliant! Oh my God, Ryan at the chair. Brilliant. <laughs> Matthew, I think Matthew, after seeing that match with the exterminator, and knowing Ryan from the, the back. He knows what Ryan can go. He knows what Ryan's limit is, and he know and he knows that <clears> it's <throat> not easy to beat Ryan. So he's be back. back. 